Hey everyone, this is part two of my Ancestry DNA results came in last year. Um, today, I'm going to talk about my DNA circles. Uh, part one, unfortunately, I wasn't able to finish part one of my, my video. For some reason, uh, as I was recording, for some reason, it had stopped. So I thought I'd do a part two of of my DNA results come in. Also, in my DNA results, I have what you called two DNA circles. The last videotape that I had recorded, I said it was unusual. I will take back what I just said. It's not unusual. Um, even though I am 89%, you know, African, you know, I'm considered an African diaspora. That means, you know, my ancestors, you know, they were removed from, from, from Africa and now, you know, you know, they came into America and what have you. So it's not unusual to have, you know, some European, um, DNA. We all know the story and what have you. I don't need to, um, explain even further and what have you. So I take it back, um, as far as my DNA circles are concerned, it's not unusual. And it is what it is. I have two DNA circles on my on my in, in my DNA. Okay, getting back to the video. I had put it on pause for a moment. Uh, you see, this is last the last video I have recorded, I, I share with you my my ethnicity estimate and on this side I have what you call DNA matches and what have you so on based on the last video recorded um, video um, I'll show you DNA matches and I have sure I have shared with you there's one cousin you know that I had pointed out who is in my DNA matches now these are just new people just popped up like like her, 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 and her, and so forth and so on. So this is um, view all DNA matches, just to you know probably give you an idea how it works. And let me see if I can use this mouse right now. I got the. It's good to get the Android TV box. I'm using this keypad. Let me see if I can click OK to give you an idea of how it works okay hold on a sec just bear with me for a moment let me click enter if I can. right now so it breaks down according to um second cousins third cousin here's my cousin Patricia she had taken her DNA Miss Sad Sad Junior <clears throat> that's my cousin Cynth Cynthia Addison Vernice Moore she's a cousin of mine on the third you have fourth cousins Liz and what have you and it just goes on and on and on and on and what have you so let me go back right now I'm gonna show you once again hold on a sec I think I went too back hold on a second okay getting back to resume yeah, I was having somewhat of technical difficulties. So I have here, this is my ethnicity results, estimate results. I don't need to show you more and more on that. And here are my DNA circles. Um, I guess I'm the first one of an African diaspora who has DNA circles. Uh, for the most part, I look, I, I was watching, um, YouTube videos on DNA circles 
uh, normally I see, you know, Anglo-Saxons, you know, they they have uh, DNA circles of their, of their peeps. But, you know, I guess this be the first video of an African diaspora like me who has on uh, DNA circles from Curtis Rose. You know, he's he's a European on uh, you could say European diaspora as well as James Green Brownie European diaspora on um, he has on um, 40 members and it's interesting to know I was reading on on James Green Brownie you know of of his history and his brother name is Jonathan Brownie and I believe his brother Jonathan Brownie uh, was good friends with Abraham Lincoln and you know, I didn't know that he has, you know, he had a company called, you know, the Browning Gun. And and there is an actual market out there called the Browning Gun. So I'm going to click in a few 40 members if it can open up. Just to give you an idea of how this DNA circle, it says, you, you're related to James Green Browning. Uh, James Green Brownie is your DNA evidence connects you to his DNA circle, which so far includes 40 of his descendants. And and it break down who is in a DNA circle. I don't need to read that. Um, right here, you can read more about you know James Green Brownie and what have you. Okay, now here. Are the descendants of James Green Brownie and I'm just gonna give you an idea how it works you see me on the top here and you have other people's you know are in the within the DNA circles of James Green Brownie and what have you so let me just click one person out of the list I'm trying to multitask here trying to use my one hand with the let me see if I can click into this one here DS group family and you see some people here you know Sarah Ann Brownie group um, G Tate Green Hagen and what have you let's see Eric Bean click in here See four members. If they can click, I don't think it can click. But in any event, you know this shows that you know I have James Green Ground in my circles, and there are other people in the group too. Here, you see these these faces pop up on the DNA circles. And more peeps here, here. Okay, right here. Just want to give a shout out to the Brownings. Hi, Brownings. Hi, family. <laughs> Yes. So I just want to show you, you know, illustration how DNA circles work. Um, unfortunately, I don't have any hints that can actually pinpoint that common ancestor, but the common ancestor is James Green Brownie, you know, unequivocally. Let me, re let me say that again, unequivocally, being that I have 7% European, you know, I am an African diaspora, as well as 7% European diaspora, you know. And what have you so let me go back let's go to Curtis Rose Curtis Rose just have like about 13 peeps in the DNA circles let me click on that right now it's loading by the way get the Android TV box right here MX3 MX3 I got it from gearbest.com 
from Gigabix. And I bought this as an accessory, this keyboard. You know, I'm unofficially endorsing the, 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 the miniature keypad as well as this. That's how I'm able to um, connect to the internet through by HDMI 2. <laughs> yes. So right here it says you are ready to Curtis Rose and what have you. And I don't need to read all of that, you know, and so forth and so on. Um, learn more about Curtis Rose. Let me bring the mouse here. I'm using my thumb to connect. Well, let's go back. We're not going to read the history of Curtis Rose, but I just wanted to sh share with you relationship list. You know, some of the lists I'm not going to go in depth. He hear me? Here am I again? And uh, like two groups here. If I click into at least farmer, let me see if I can bring the mouse close here. I click enter. See what it pops up. And these are the people within the list and what have you. Let me go back here again. Let me click in GGR rows. Click in here. And it'll show up, you know, people within this list here. Confidence strong. Just like James Green Brownie, everything here is strong, strong, strong. So once again, I have, you know, you know, I'm I'm connected to two Europeans, James Green Brownie, as well as Curtis Rose. From what I heard that Curtis Rose perhaps have uh, royalty back and, you know, was married in the 1830s. I don't know whether he was a king in France. I don't know. Um, based on someone who was communicating with me. So I don't know. I'm Maybe I'm part of royalty. Here's the, the Curtis Rose uh, crest. So I don't know if if I'm part of royalty and what have you. And so forth and so on. Okay. Getting back. So once again. Like part one. I, sh I share with y'all. My. My. Estimate. Ethnicity estimate. Part one also. I share with my DNA matches. But this is part two. But now there are newer people had popped up who had taken the test. It seemed like Ancestry DNA, you know, is growing in leaps and bounds, you know, it has grown in popularity. A lot of people are taking it. And it is important to take the, the test because, you know, you want to know as an African American, you want to know who are you and what have you. You know, like I said, we were taken away from, you know, our family. You know, our you know, our our native land, you know, and our ancestors, you know, they came to America and some went to South America, you know, on uh, Central America and what have you, and so forth and so on. Pretty much that's my part two of my DNA circles, yes. I take it back. It's not unusual. It's is it's common that a person who is an African diaspora, you know, has you know European DNA. It's not unusual, but I guess I'm the first video of one who has European um, DNA in me and what have you. So yes, I I celebrate who I am. I'm an African, eighty nine percent African. I'm 2% Asian South, 
1% Native American Indian. Um, what else I am? 1% uh, Pacific Islander, Melanesia. And I'm 7% European. So out of that 7%, you know, I'm 3% Iberian Peninsula. And I guess I have Spanish in me from Portugal or Spain. I think it's Spain. Um, 2%, you know, Ireland in me. I got the blessing of the Irish in me. <laughs> That's why I can do a good um, Irish person. You know, there's a pot of gold of the rainbow. <laughs> hey, it's in the blood. It's in the blood. <laughs> I could do a impersonation, but yes. First of lucky charms. It's magically delicious. <laughs> you know, but I, I celebrate. I'm, you know, I'm Irish. Um, 1% 1 European West and 1% European East. Um, 1% West can be Great Britain, England, or 1% West can be Italy or parts of Russia, you know, you know, the Czech Republic, who knows, you know, but you know, I'm, I'm black as it can be, <laughs> but also I'm, I'm mixed. I celebrate who I am, you know, and people often ask me, you know, where did you come from? I, I do get that a lot. People say, where do you come from? I said, you know, uh, you know, I said, I have to give the the laundry list of, you know, how I got to America through my ancestors and, and and so forth and so on. You know, people say, you know, I look West Indian. Some people say I look Native American. I, I get a whole bunch of stuff, you know. Yeah, so I celebrate who I am. All right. To the family of James Green Browning and Curtis Rose, just want to say I'm proud to be a part of y'all guys. You know, I love y'all all and what have you, you know. You know, I'm proud to be black, and I'm part of. I'm proud to be seven percent Caucasian. You know, and that's why. You know, God deals with me in ministry. I want a multiplicit ministry, so I can reach all cultures, all nationalities, and what have you. That's it. All right. Take care. God bless. Goodbye.